maintain our perfect arena record because he went king h4. I made like four pre moves there with under a second less. Wow. That was crazy. <laughs> we got him. We got him. And here we go in the arena. Won all the games. Trying to catch the top. Oh, 1700. Gives us a good opportunity to berserk. Ooh, that's a Von Popiel Gambit transposition. That's a Von Popiel transposition. No Scandies. No Scandies here. A threatened stuff. Classic Von Popiel tricks. Here we go. Big advantage now. Bishop c8, most common move. But not a good move. Alright, I was just doing Von Popiel training last week. Just doing training. What do we got here? Oh, d5 should be big. Big, maybe big. d5, queen 2. Alright, whatever. We could just develop normal. I can't believe I'm letting him get away with this. It'll be okay though. We'll come back here, put pressure on h7. And with the pressure, so that the issue there that comes up in Von Popiels often is that when you play h6, I'm gonna take it twice. Otherwise, there's a ton of pressure on h7 because I'm just gonna pressure this knight. Add more things to it, like that or that. Um, and then eventually it just cracks. So you could play g6 to deal with it. Um, that has, you know, its own problems. What do you do there? Okay. Bishop back. So no threats yet, because he still has a knight that can defend this. But I'd like, okay, he already is going with that move. Step the queen up, tie the knight down to, to this pin. What I'd like to do is on here but i didn't exactly get my queen out of the way <laughs> so what are my other ideas i can bring a rook there seems legit glider glider thank you so much for the subscribe really appreciate it for six months in advance Very, very much appreciated. We are now at eight subscribers. This is just my second stream since um, since making affiliate and becoming subscriberable. So, doing well, getting this work across. Thank you again to Glider Guider One. Um, okay, let's get that. Let's trade here. <laughs> Dodge the queen trade, bring my rook that way. Oh no! <laughs> Sorry that I didn't update the go live notification. <laughs> Oops. Typically it prompts me to update it. Um, I guess it didn't this time. Sunday morning. Where where are you in the world that it's Sunday morning? Six. I'm gonna run out of time here, by the way. Hopefully not. Oh yeah, I did get my knight of six in. Seeing some queen sacrifices for mate. Though maybe I don't have to take with the queen. I'll take with the bishop. Maybe I should have taken with the queen. He has check. Is it working? Wait. This. Wait. Take. Sack the queen. Queen h6. Oh, wait. It's not me. Or wait. It's not me. Shoot. Unless. That's not mate. Unless he goes there. Oh, he did! 
Wow. And we maintain our perfect arena record because he went king h4. I made like four pre moves there with under a second less. Wow. That was crazy. <laughs> we got him. We got him. Oh man, that that should have been mate. I just didn't have enough time, but we made it happen. Nice, and we maintain a perfect arena. Yeah, yeah, I'll definitely look back at that game. I have g5, knight back, g4. I think that traps the queen. Isn't that crazy? g5. He resigned. Yeah, g4 traps the queen. That's a nice one. Okay, tournament pairings are now closed. Not bad for a pretty high berserk rate. You know, did my best. Um, late joined it. So let's go back to this game. So a bit of a wild game, but we're winning here once we get that knight into f6. Strong check. Of course, this is going to win the queen now. These pieces are dead the whole game. Okay. So I had here, lost, yeah, you're right. Lost force checkmate sequence. So I had takes, takes, check. I had just like no time on my clock here. So I was only going to do this if it was me. I knew this should be still just winning because I should just crash through here. Takes, 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 queen h6. So if he goes queen h7, then this is mate. It's a good mating pattern to know. The knight can just deliver this mating pattern by controlling these squares. Check, check, take, check. Here's where I didn't see anything. Because I saw bishop d3, there's knight f5. Right? Otherwise, bishop d3, this would be mate. Where it comes there. Look at all my pieces working so well. But check, here. I didn't really even see bishop h5 too much. And then all the way back. Gorgeous mate. Look at look at how gorgeous that mate is. So the knight controls this, the bishop controls that, so they form a screen here, and then the rook does that. And th this rook did a big part by preventing the king from coming to the f file. So that's a really, really nice um, checkmating sequence. I really, really like that. I can't believe I didn't play it. But this game was nonetheless a miracle. Nonetheless a miracle because here... <laughs> I was just betting on that coming around. Um, so yeah, it worked out in the end.